it's me and my screen's FPS is bad <laughs> at the moment because I'm recording and rendering a video at the same time but I wanted to talk about this and kill some time um, so this is an advanced-ish Lua concept last time I talked about detouring functions uh, you can detour meta functions as shown um, in this particular instance the idea behind doing this is that if you've downloaded firearms source that weapon pack which is really nice by the way um, if you hold E and R you'll drop the weapon it'll create the weapon in front of you and, and drop it in front of you which is convenient depending on what you're doing but for me uh, I didn't want it and this is actually extracted from a game mode that I'm working on but I didn't want it uh, it interfered with my inventory system it was you know it was giving people weapons for free essentially so uh, in, okay and I would have done this the quote unquote correct way which is to go into the weapon pack and remove that function that way it doesn't you know it doesn't potentially interfere with other things but the issue being the way it was done is it was copy and pasted into every single individual weapon it was not put in the base uh, it was just copy pasted over all of them all of the individual weapons and I didn't have the patience to go through and take it out of every single weapon call me lazy what if you want it's whatever so instead I decided to simply make it so that you can't press E if you're already holding R, or I guess use and reload, because that's what he uses in his function. So this is how it did it. I overrode, or over detoured, whatever you want to call it, detoured uh, the player key down function to say that if, I mean, you can read it. You, you know, I'm not going to insult your intelligence. You can read it right there in front of you. Uh, but, and it worked the first time when I load the game mode I mean I can't use and reload at the same time it doesn't work it fixes the problem but there's an issue with this uh, snippet of code that you're looking at right now there's an issue it is a critical issue and it causes the game to crash or I guess freeze or hang until I end the process um, on the when it is reloaded when it is auto refreshed by gmod whenever I save a different file or whatever in the game mode uh, I could not use auto refresh for a while because it would crash the game and it eventually got to the point where I was bugged by it and I set out on a course I set out on a determined mission to fix whatever was causing this and it boiled down to right here this snippet of code. I'll give you, like, while I've been talking, um, you know, I'll give you a couple seconds to see if you can figure out what it is. Do you see it? I feel like I'm playing, like, uh, like a little kid's game or something on the like a t kids TV show where they're just like belittling you but anyway uh, if you don't see it it's on line 3 uh, this is the problem right here is when I set this old key down to key down now this works the first time because key down is its original self it's it's what it's supposed to be but the problem lies in when I redefine it as this when I detour it when it is refreshed this does not default to like gmod's default key down it just keeps this and then it ends up going around in circles especially seeing as I use the function within it see right here and right here I use its old self within it so basically what ends up happening is it's gonna go around and around and around and around an infinite loop um, most infinite loops are caught by Gmod and it says hey you have an infinite loop in order to prevent crashing your game we're not gonna allow this piece of code to run but this seems to be an exception to the rule when you're detouring a function and you use the function inside the old version of the function inside the new one 
on the auto refresh it is going to create an infinite loop and fuck you over so there is a way to fix this do not uh, fret and it is very simple that's it that is literally it that's all you need to do to fix this issue and the way it works is extremely simple basically what it's saying is if old key down is a thing then it will set itself to itself the same thing can be written in this manner It, it, that, it's the same thing, basically. So if old key down is already defined, as in it's been defined before the refresh, then it will do nothing. But if this is nil, Lua will use this, like, this is just a shorthand version of this. Um, then it will define it as what it needs to be, the old version of key down. That's all. That's all. This prevents an infinite loop and allows the game mode to auto refresh properly without causing any crashes. So, uh, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope this is useful to you. If you ever have to detour and you're wondering why every time you save uh, your game mode crashes or your game crashes, this may be the culprit. And it's not necessarily a uh, meta function like on the player or on an entity or something. I'm sure it. <laughs> Fuck you, Titus. I'm sure it could exist elsewhere on just ordinary functions as well. So, uh, if this is useful to you, I'm glad. If it's not, maybe it will be in the future. Uh, so, thank you for watching. Um, that's it.